My name is Tessa Hale. I'm a physical therapist and Coraline Master Instructor, and we're here in Salt Lake City, Utah at Pinnacle Performance. If we're trying to do side bending for someone with scoliosis, we often want to limit the side bend in one area while we want to increase it in another area. So if I wanted to have side bending in the upper back, I could place his hand high about shoulder height, keeping the side bending high in his spine. And then on the opposite side of his curve, I could place his hand lower. And as he presses out and sides bend, now he has more ability to side bend into the deeper part of his low back, accommodating his curves.